Hey, good morning, my friends, the chosen ones. I'm over here in Orchid, California, and uh, going to do an audit over here at this pipeline, petroleum pipeline, whatever you want to call it right here. And we have this place over here. But um, I was going to tell you all, these people over here in Orchid, they're mighty cagey. Like little mice running around trying to get in the way, trying to intimidate and aggravate and frustrate and just push the old buttons, you know, any which way they can. This is the back of the town over here where I'll be going a little later where they have their city hall and whatnot, but it really smells bad in here. This stuff, whatever it is, and then this big tank, and then they got like, this is where they have their farmer's market, apparently. It says up there on the sign, farmer's market. So I guess they use this street for that. And then over here they have all these pipes and stuff. I thought I'd show you, and all these signs. You know how us auditors love signs, well, they have them mother load over here safety first report all accidents no matter how small to your supervisor no smoking poisonous gas illegal drugs or paraphernalia by anyone notice uh, is beverages anything you want you can have it over here no intoxicate all intoxicating sub substances in anyways now it says no cameras no explosives no intoxicating sub no 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 and there's no in case of an emergency call 877-267-229 oh petroleum pipeline and over here they have more Overhead. Phone monitor. And you got these guys over here at me. What's she doing? She's feeling. Here he comes. Morning. Hi. I was just wondering if there's someone to help you with. Uh, not unless you have gas for my vehicle. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, this isn't a resetting or anything like that. So. Oh, yeah. darn. What do you do here? It would be nice though, right? Yeah. <laughs> what do you do? I'm sorry? What do you do here? Oh, I'm a person for Philip 66. Oh really? Oh Philip 66. So that is a gas type, type of thing right? Uh, but a different kind like for houses or? No so that'd be like SoCal gas. Oh. Yeah so Philip 66 mainly deals with uh, crude. Crude gas? Uh, crude oil. Oh crude oil? Yeah. Oh what is that for? Uh, refining into gasoline products. Oh it is? Yeah. Oh okay. Oil for your Vehicles, tires, uh, asphalt for this new road that they just built. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. okay. oh, cool. Well, that's what you got. They've been around for a long time. Oh, yeah. They used to be Conoco, and then they switched over to Phillips, and so on and so forth. Huh. Yeah, because I remember that from when I was little. That little Phillips 66 thing. Yeah, it's been around for a Because they, they used to have gas stations, right? Didn't they? Yeah, they still do. Well, I, so they oh, have yeah. like a bunch of brand names. So 
76 is part oh, of Oh, is that one of theirs? Yeah. Oh, okay, so the little like, orange ball. Yeah, and there's a, there's a bunch of other ones all across the United States. And, oh, okay. Yeah. So what goes way out there on that road? How come those people are all riding? Because I, actually, I came out here, I was looking for the post office. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're yeah, pretty so, cagey out here in Lompoc, you know, like they... So you're talking about when they were doing all the activity over here? Yeah. Yeah, so that was all SoCal gas. Oh, it was? Yeah, so they were running a new gas line. Oh, okay. Yeah, but uh, our pipeline runs through there, so uh, we were out there just making sure that... That they didn't collide? Yeah, there was no uh, incidents, stuff like that. Anytime there's any activity near our pipeline, uh, obviously we have to be out there to yeah. oversee anything. Oh. So they were getting a little close, too close for comfort. <laughs> Your competition. <laughs> yeah, so once, once we see that there's no conflict, you know, we can kind of back off and, you know, let them do their thing. Oh, okay. Oh, that's interesting. Kind of, kind of a, I mean, this is all under pressure, right? This gas, because I could hear it over there. That noise. Oh, uh, that's for the, for some equipment that we run inside. Oh, so that's why you have all these, like that red one over there, all those around town. Is that all gas? Like those big... Oh, the piping coming out of the ground? Yeah. That's actually water. <laughs> oh, that's water? Yeah, that's water for our... Oh. It's actually for like if we have a fire or anything like that. Oh, really? Oh, okay. And then they have farmer's market like up here? Yeah, you know what? We just had, a, I think, the first farmer's market yesterday. Oh, okay. Yeah. And they just redid this whole road uh, because of that. So I think oh, all the right. city was out here trying to uh, kind of do something for the Oregon community. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Yeah. So where's where's the post office at? I am not sure. You don't know? <laughs> to be honest with you. I'm not actually from Orchid. Uh, oh, okay. So I don't yeah, they, they directed me out this way, but it, this looks like the... I turned here because I was like, oh, that's the end of it, because now it goes out there. There's nothing else out that way, right? No, I think that's the one over there. Oh, that's the one? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. So that goes to Lompoc, then. That must go to Lompoc. That's why those people are... Yeah. Because there's only so many ways to get to Lompoc or to the base, to the the army base yeah, or whatever. Yeah, there's not a lot of highways out here in Central Coast. I mean, you got like the 101 and then the PCH, but yeah, you know, huh? Uh, yeah. yeah. Runs a lot. And of course, Orchid's community is pretty small, so there's not a whole lot of uh, things happening. Out there. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, you are? It's a larger city. Uh, so do you know San Joaquin Valley Transparency, those guys? Um, no. You don't? But we used to do a lot of work uh, when I was working for a different company with uh, like Dogger and uh, San Joaquin Valley Air Pollution District and stuff like that. Oh, really? Oh, okay. You should look them up, San Joaquin Valley Transparency. They're, they're, they live in Bakersfield. Oh, really? Yeah. They yeah, so believe it or not, like it's kind of crazy the way I've experienced things in my career and uh, you know the oil and gas industry they've really done a lot to try and keep all their products in the pipe or in the tanks you know oh uh, really things to atmosphere and i know there's regulatory things that we do amongst our company where we'll have third parties come out and check all of our uh, instrumentation that might have natural gas running through it or crude running through it and they'll come out and uh to do gas detections, you know, make sure that we're not releasing really anything out into the atmosphere. Oh, that's so, good. Yeah, they've, they've changed a lot. And, huh. uh, I know when I first started, they were like, oh, there's a oil spill? Yeah, we'll clean it up, you know, later this week. Uh -huh. And now it's kind of like, a, it's you know, they've made it a larger uh, task to do. Right? Priority. Yeah. Like, get to sure. it. Yeah. That's cool. And that's Live and learn, just, huh? Uh, producers and oil companies just trying to um, you know stay in business here in California so you know we're just trying to comply with all the environmental regulations that are out there that must not be easy no and I know like a company like Phillips is uh, is one of the uh, leading companies in doing environmental uh, you know precautions oh they are 
they're the like the um, authority or the. They're one of they're one of the, the top companies who are you know making the standard for all the other producers that are out there in the industry. Um, you got to try to keep up with the Joneses, in other words, like. Yeah, and I know it can get expensive as, for safety as well. It's the same thing. Phillips? Yeah. Where are they located? Uh, so our headquarters is in Houston. Oh, in Houston? Oh, okay. Wow. So do they have a, a place out here somewhere? Phillips? Um, we have the refinery, like the but Phillips? Uh, as far as that goes, there's really not like a headquarters out here. Um, maybe I think we have one in Long Beach. Uh, oh, yeah. An office out of Long Beach. Oh, yeah. Probably because they have a big refinery out there. Yeah, and then of course we provide all the jet fuel probably majority of it for um, LAX. So, oh, you do? Oh, wow. I just learned that one recently. I was like, wow, like uh, we have like a line that goes right into them and we feed them. And so, uh, oh, right. Cool. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that. Did you go with uh, Renee back to the station and jump in and stuff? Call control and do whatever you gotta do. Thanks a lot. Yeah, Thanks. Okay. Nice guy. Yeah, I won't go in. Don't worry. I'm going to go. He, he told me. He told me already. Okay. Thank you. I'm listening to what he said. He's a nice guy. Thanks. Pleasure. Yeah, he explained it to me. I didn't know it was all gas and everything. That it's like gas under pressure and all that. Because I could hear it over there. Yeah. So, pipeline. yeah. All right. Take care. That guy was nice, but they didn't want him talking to me. Come over here and look at this. She kind of clean it up after they use it for that, don't you think? Evacuation assembly. Here's the other side. He said this is water. Here. That guy was all tensed out, right? like Mr. Tostaron over there. Here. They got all those notices over here too. Emergency shutdown. Look. We're all getting butt hurt over there. <laughs> Maybe I'm gonna have to get out the baby. <laughs> Here, let's screw with her. We ate that. Let's see what this guy's license plate. Santa Maria. But this, these pipes are here. Yeah. 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 Go all the way to wrap around this way. I see a light for here. Wait, they're looking at me. Some kind of crane thing. 
has a motor. Is that? She can lift something up off of that, I guess. Evacuation. Private property back there. Car open. Guess I better get back over there. Before somebody gets into it. That's somebody's private property back there. There's a gate, but if you walk right over here, you can just go right over there. There's a water tank back there. Check. I'm gonna lock my car because these guys are all on the phone. I think they're calling the police. They're all butt hurt. <laughs> Honey, this guy's car is on. Oh no, this is that stuff. Mm -hmm. oh, this from this stuff. NC Tyrant Hunter likes these kinds of places. And those guys that are hanging out together over there. They get all butt hurt over it. We need to make sure I lock my van. And I'll walk back around and around. Because they're all on the phone. They stand around on their phones. Caution. Telephone cable. That thing up there. Right there. I just like the window cracked open. Here's the other side of the gate over here. You can see him over here.
Oh, here comes another guy. Oh, excuse me for a minute. No? Can I help you? No, sir. Okay. Just normally we don't have people out here videotaping our facilities, so oh. it always raises questions. Security concerns. Really? Yeah. I don't know who you are. A good citizen. A good citizen. I don't pose any threat. I'm just filming.